All right, got the recording started again. I'm actually gonna take a really quick bathroom break, so everybody go fill up your drinks and whatnot. Get some snack. I might get a snack too. Shoot, man. But I will be right back. Oh, what Vaseline does Darth Vader have? I have no idea because she's not a Dalish elf. <laughs> Except she is in. Oh, she has Dirthamins then. I think I gave her Dirthamins Vaseline in Inquisition because that fits her. Her name. Her name is a derivative of Dirthamin anyway. So, but yes, <laughs> I will be right back. Okay. Wow. I was talking for a second, and then it turns out it wasn't on. <laughs> My microphone was off. Okay, sorry. I am gonna I'm gonna order some pizza really quick because that's my job on the weekends. I buy the pizza and the Parmesan bites because I'm addicted and I really just can't get enough of them. I order them like two or three times a week, except only two or three times every other week because I'm only home every two or three times every other week. But you said something about creepy sounds? Oh. I can hear it. it. Sounds like metal. I hear it. I hear it. Mm. Order online. Delivery, because I'm lazy. Then I don't know, it's like five minutes from my house, but I cannot be asked to leave my house. Cannot. Cannot. Ooh, two large topping and an eight-piece stuffed cheesy bread for 15 bucks? you joking me, right? That's awesome. Oh no, large two topping. Dang it. <laughs> Never mind. I know they have Canadian bacon. This is stupid. Maybe they just call it ham. Like the heathens we are, Americans. I'm sorry. This is so, so exciting. I know. <laughs> oh no, I should get to see... She's excited when she's sleeping and hits herself in the face and the tail. <laughs> they love too much. Doggies. We're talking about dogs and pizza. Ooh, a blind shih tzu. Cute. You hate being a cliche, but you have tea and biscuits, Larry! That's amazing! You rock your tea and biscuits. Do you like biscuits as in like cookies or like biscuits as in like little pastries? All right, I just spent way too much money on pizza. That's what happens when you buy for a family of like seven though. Yay, it's Saturday night, it's probably gonna take ages. Oh my gosh, lemon tea. You have cookies! Let me... ah! I love, I love the pictures of the ca dogs trying to sleep in tiny cat beds with the cats laying in like the big dog beds. You have a German Shepherd Golden Retriever mix? Oh my gosh, that sounds like a Golden German Shepherd. That sounds cute. And she doesn't bark? Oh, you're so lucky. My dog only communicates and barks. He's just, oh my gosh, you guys hear him sometimes. He just, he just, he's a tiny little 35 pound bag of crap. But he's cute. <laughs> He's cute as sin. He also causes me a lot of trouble. 
currently trying to make it so we don't have to do anything drastic with him because he's been in a lot of trouble lately but we're working on it hoping it works out trying my best all right cool well that was like 20 minutes spent trying to get dang them pizza done <laughs> when you have some food and she wants some uh my dog i had a couple dogs that didn't bark much one of them had been abused when she was younger and she didn't bark i can't count on one hand how many times she barked and every time she did we were like oh good girl <laughs> you know because she never barked you love it when you can hear my dog jangling around in the background <laughs> <laughs> That's good because he does it a lot. Even when he's, he actually spends a lot of time sleeping on my bed while I'm recording. Um, and he'll just get up and like shake sometimes and like lay on the ground and just keep sleeping. But sometimes when he gets up, I'm like, oh shoot, time to go. <laughs> time to go, let him out. Dorian, you got anything new to say? We should talk. I need to talk to you. About how much you were yeah. me, I assume? I hear that story. Shut up. Let's hang out. Let's do something interesting. More interesting than wandering the countryside Perish the random thought. strangers. Yours barks at hedgehogs? Uh, you insist, a game of wicked grace <laughs> has to do. Time to take all your Oh, <laughs> what? That's a new one? I love it. Dorian's romance is awesome. Like, I love it, like, I mean, you don't get to see it, but, like, you can imagine it happening. Like, I like that. It's so different. Like, Cullen's, like, you just walk up and kiss him. Like, Blackwall's, you walk up and kiss him. Dorian, you can walk up and kiss him. And you can just hang out. I love that. She just keeps walking. Your dog, she's like, no. <laughs> no, I'm not interested. Uh, we have one more mission, sort of. What was it? Worship. Worship. Oh, yeah. We gotta go open the... Yes, in this, this door. That's right. I was distracted. Did I do the things? Did I, did I save? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I know, I wish, and especially with Sol, it's like, you can't even kiss him. Like, every other romance, you can walk up and kiss them. But I wish with Sol, you could walk up and hang out with him. I don't even want to kiss him all the time. I think that that's fine, if you don't. I just want to hang out with him. I did notice that with my human noble. Like, I could just go hang out with Sarah on the roof. And I was like, oh, hey, look at that. Someone's turning into a bit of a dragon hunter, I've heard. Tee hee hee. Oh, there we go. Got the Draculist now. Marquis Buffoon. The demons were savage. Oh. Okay. Be careful with the wardens. Okay. Improving morale. I do love this one. A small shipment of books arrived earlier. You can't kiss Solus. No, you can't. You can't. You don't even have special. Like the only thing he'll say is when you leave, he'll he's like Venon or something. Like when you walk up, he says Venon, which means my heart. You can't talk to him about other things except for the other things that are already prescriptive for everybody, and you can't just kiss him, whenever you want. With Josephine, you can hang outside in the hang out outside in the garden. Yeah. Are the soldiers ready? As ready as they can be. Oh, They're Josephine is totally the Disney princess. Oh, sorry, Seshu. Well, I'm glad you can hang out. I know it's probably super duper late over there. <laughs> glad you could hang out for a bit. I'll try to do earlier ones. Yeah, 3 a.m. Rock on. Well, at least we were able to get the glyphs with you. I will, I will at least open it. Uh, 
Oh, a Dalish elf named Cillian. Okay. It, I think he's a multiplayer character. That dates back to the original Elven Nation or even earlier. Yeah, see ya! It requires some gifts to several Dalish clans traveling along the Waking Sea coast, but Cillian was able to get the text he needed to translate the glyphs. He claims they are a kind of map showing the location of an ancient temple dedicated to Durthamin, the elven god of, se god of secrets. He has provided us a location, but it should be noted that we're not the first to investigate these glyphs. A group of treasure hunters evidently mentioned them several years ago, but they have not been heard from since. We'll go in a moment. Uh, we have... Marquis Buffoon trapped in her fortress. We're afraid we found something we earlier, have ignored her transgressions in light of the greater threat of the world. It's clear that we did not. Her crimes go well beyond smuggling or illegal mining, and she's an ally in Lady Lagsep, who has come with Venatori mages to defend the Marquis. The wardens have concerns about the Venatori using the blood magic or their ties to Creepies to influence their minds, but are prepared to follow your orders. You cannot delay for long as demons in the mountains continue to harass our flanks. If the, no, no, no. If my scouts can find an alternate entrance, the Venatory may not have time to affect the Wardens. We have no choice but to send the Wardens in. No. If the Wardens can hold off the demons for three days, my friend Baroness Lassouche will have siege equipment there to bring down that fortress. Hmm. Uh. I kind of don't want to send the Wardens out at all. To be honest. Oh, that's oh, that's one that's a difficult one. Secure a source of water. For Griffin Wing Outpost, my favorite? Of course. Go Cullen. To go work. Cullen go. Oh my gosh. Oh. Do, 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 do. Wow, holy crap. It better be good whatever's in there. Let's see what we have. It does. Do you like the war table mechanic? I do too. I wish we could experience more of it like in person, but it is nice and I kind of wish we could like move the pieces around, but I mean that's just that's just nitpicking, you know. Oh, I should do Red Jenny. Oh. Charade knows her tricks. Long memory too. Nice. Oh. Ooh, it's for several honorable militias who would want no part of this. Perhaps we can take away their business. They didn't know where money went. Test their commitment. Confront them directly and demand the ringleader's name. It is. It's a cool way to get it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. The Blade of Tidarian? Yes, Sheree Gamlin's daughter. I can't wait to have my Dragon Age 2 save on this, and I'll be like, Sheree, ah! I know you. Oh yeah. It's the it's the one that you can have as a as a sword. Yes. I really like that one. I like having the schematic for it. It's so good. And it's fun for Vivian because she is a, uh, yeah, it's a night enchant. Perfect for a night enchanter. Let's do it Josephine's way. Mm, what was that? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Let's go. Dorian with his- I love Dorian's romance card. It's beautiful. 
Brian, Cassandra, and Solus. Why isn't Solus cards changed? Brand is uh, from hunting. I don't. Ooh, who's? I can't rem remember. Brand. Hi, <laughs> Ashley. We were talking about you earlier. <laughs> How long has the stream been going? Uh, you know. <laughs> Hi, Ashley. <laughs> I know. For some reason, notifications aren't working. Uh, <laughs> it's been on for a while. <laughs> it has. Kind of maybe two hours. <laughs> yeah. I like Talus. I wish it really weirded me out that she didn't show up at the end either of Dragon Age 2. It was like they threw her in and they were like, maybe you'll see her again. And then you never saw her again. So, yeah. You know what's nice? Ashley, though, we'll just say all we've done is get some scattered glyphs from the Exalted Plains and to open up the Temple of Durthamon and order pizza. That's all I've done. Basically. <laughs> You've been a trespasser! Oh, what did you think? Oh my gosh, you have to say. Oh my gosh. Tell, tell, tell us a story, Ashley, while we go through Durthamon's temple. It'd be cool. I was actually kind of surprised in retrospect, that she wasn't in Dragon Age Inquisition. Is she in a War Table mission, though, Frog Raider? You cried, Ashley? Oh, no, you didn't! Of course you did! Oh, it was great! <laughs> Larry, you gave that staff to someone without seeing what it was and was like, why are you swinging the sword? Oh, yes, yes. I also did inventory, Ashley. <laughs> For the last two hours, that's what we've done. Oh, uh, man, should have brought Sarah to this. And kill the... Stop! <laughs> no, what the heck? You're never going to let me forget it. No. It's at every time. I, I only ever kill, like, one Hala in a playthrough... And it's every time it's in the Exalted Plains, and it just makes me so mad. <laughs> I'm like, why? And kill Tahala. I, I am so upset with you right now. <laughs> Woo, I, I really wanted to get this temple done, by the way, because Talon is dedicated to um, never forget. <laughs> Because uh, Talon is dedicated to Falun Din, the god of death, and Durthamon is basically his twin, right? So, I wanted to get this done for sure, because it's definitely something that Talon would be very interested in. You had to side with the Knorr and the Chargers die, then Talus will have several war table missions. Interesting. Oh my gosh, the last mission was so cute. Your character says I love you, and Bull says I love you. Oh, it would break my heart. You think you saw it's young walking off? You jerk! <laughs> there are no baby holla in this game. There's no babies anywhere in this game. Everyone just appears out of nowhere. <laughs> Yeah, at the end, when you're like, the, the mark is killing you, and you're like, like actually killing you, and you're going to get Solus, there's, there's a time there for anybody who doesn't romance Solus to have a moment with their love interest, where basically, I think, I, I've heard Dorian's, and it breaks my heart. I'm pretty sure if it's the one I'm thinking of, I'm like, <laughs> I'm sorry. I haven't even romanced you yet in a trespasser, and I'm sorry. I never I left. Never left. I don't know why, because it seems like it's pretty easy to get out of, you know, but. No, 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 I would never, even for Talus, I would never kill the Chargers. Nope, nope, nope. Chronicle of the Search for something called Durthamon's Wisdom. Elven Gods of Secrets, Disappear all their kin. 
His priesthood remained behind. I wonder if we found the Temple of Durthamen. Interesting that we found the key to the Temple of Durthamen in Sile's shrine. Yes. Wow. Why did you do that? That was terrifying. Uh, you finally... Oh, good! Did you get him on sale? Larry gifted me the Dragon Age Origins for PC the other day. So I get to play that on PC too. Apparently it was on a sale. So, I, and I, and they were like, oh, we don't want you to miss it. And I was like, oh, you're the best. <laughs> Origins is rocking. I love it. I mean, it's hard and it's different in a lot of ways, but I like it. Uh, Durthamon's rituals will evidently allow it. Perhaps one of the oldest secrets we know of will be revealed to us here. For the resting place of the wisdom. Okay, I mean, I remember this one. We, you know, we basically, we do, we summon the... Shoot! Oh, no, wait, Emero, we're fine. I was like, last time I remember, I just happened to bring Sarah with me. And, uh... Oh, you can see, the, this, this, this mural is usually much larger and higher up, so you don't usually get to see the faces in such close details. Oh, are those facial markings? Are those Valisleen? I mean, maybe that's obvious, but I didn't quite realize. Hang on, let me try to see. I think one of those, the, the third one from the right, I think that's Fallon Dins. Like, a really... Because that's what Talon has on his face. That's right, Frog Raider. Your completionist run Romance Bull and killed the Chargers to keep him true to the Kuhn. So that's how for sure you would know. Origins is so difficult. Ashley, I'm 100%. Frog Raider is actually the only reason I got through Origins with my sanity intact. Like, they basically, like, sat me down with every battle and, like, gave me, like, a, a like, 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 like a... Not, I'm not even a cheat sheet, a cheat sheet sometimes, but like a, here's how you do tactics and like here's a good idea, here's a good way to do it, and like just lots and lots of lots of teaching, lots of lots of lots of tutoring, basically on how to. Hey, look, look, Solas, you see that wolf statue over there in Dorthamon's temple? What's it doing here? <gasps> the deep roads. Oh, Roma. Ah! <laughs> you know what? I am eternally proud of the fact that the brood mother only took me one try. Everybody else died, and I was still alive. Darthara was still alive, and she happened to be standing on one piece of ground where the tentacles weren't coming up, and nothing could reach me except for the occasional, like, dark spawn running over, and I was just chucking spells at the brood mother. And oh my gosh, it, I didn't die. My care, my companions all died. I lived. You hated the deep roads, Ashley. Ashley. Oh my gosh, I freaking I got there and I couldn't finish. I had to like leave. I did the deep roads in like seven parts because I was like, what even is this? Like I was so upset. And then by the end, it was one of the last places I completed, and my warden was so jaded by the end of it. Especially the song that that dwarven woman sings, ah, like that. I was humming. I was. I was. You can even. You can watch it. I was like humming to myself to try to not hear what she was saying. I did not. I wanted nothing to do with what she was saying. It was horrible. It was horrible. Solas, if you're not gonna tell us anything, be useful. No, 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 no. You don't get to light the veil fire because you're irresponsible with it. I will light the veil fire. Give me the veil fire. Also known as that boss. <laughs> Everyone hates the deep roads. She freaked the crap out of me. That lady, the lady did. Not th the brood mother was just horrific, but that girl, the girl was like <laughs> wrong on so many levels and I felt so bad for her. We few whisper here, 
where shadow dwells, some words remain unuttered. Truths are pushed down, down, where they shall never arise again. It's strange that I can understand that. The secrets of this temple have remained unspoken for too long. They wish to be known. What? Does, does an elven mage say that too? Because can, canonically, canonically, only elven, Dalish elven mages can read. Um can read Elven, which bothers me to no end. You actually really love her spats over here. He used to light the fire. <laughs> you you liked you liked that vid seeing me get fired up about something like that, Roma? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, it totally gives a sense of atmosphere. I, I'm not saying, like, I, I'm, I'm glad they put it in. But I was just, like, I could still hear what she was saying. And it was, I mean, it was, it was horrible. It was horrible what the Darkspawn put the women through. Like, it's horrible what they put the men Goodbye. through. But I would rather bite my tongue than have to go through what they go through. Like, it's not just shoving darkspawn flesh down your throat. Like, it's not a good time in any way, shape, or form. So, oh, hey, there was a torch already down. Nice. Or no, that was the one Solus had. <laughs> Don't think your human rogue said that. Maybe it's just elves? Huh. All right. Well, it kind of, there are little things about this game that kind of irk me because my, my, my elven warrior was able to read in the temple of Mythal. She was able to read a couple of the words, but Solas asked her to translate, or she, she asked Solas to translate the rest. Um... And I was like, well, technically, if sh But see, if I was her, I would have been teaching myself Elven from a child, you know? Like, as a child. And especially as the Inquisitor, you can bet your cojones I'd be teaching myself Elven. Oh. Strange. Dorian! Dor Dorian, come here, buddy. You're invisible again, Dorian. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I gotta, I gotta put the veil fire in it, that's right. Oh, pizza might be here. Blighted Notion, welcome! Since you're playing, I'm gonna join. Yeah! You gonna play too? Uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> hello, 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 hello everyone. <laughs> guys are all so nice. No, Ashley, we did mention you earlier. There was something that came up where I was like, oh, yeah, because uh, Lavellin, Natalie Lavellin was um, like, oh, I want to play. And I was like, just play in the background. Ashley does. <laughs> Ashley plays while this is going on in the background. <laughs> yeah. You got new glasses, Ashley. Hey, Blighted Notion, I'm glad you were able to catch us on the stream. I think you've caught, like, one before. <laughs> but, uh... That's good. I think I'm, I think my pizza might be here. I don't know. Let me. It's like whole family pizza. So. Oh yeah, it looks like it probably was here. Okay. Dude, I love getting new glasses. I have a pair of rocking glasses that I'm wearing right now. That's how you pay for. Just put the tip. Just write a tip down on the receipt. Like, you know what I mean? Okay. It's as if the altar's waking up. That's right. We're gonna get it we're gonna get we're gonna get attacked. Uh, Talon, get your bow out, you schizophrenic. Oh wow, Cassandra just wow, wow. Cassandra just took out like everybody. It is alive. Because the creature connected to it is alive. It is but one piece of the whole. So when Solus was talking, there was cold air coming out of his mouth. 
or like like his air was like warming up the air because his breath was warming up the air because it was cold for a second. That was cool. Pizza Inquisition! Heck yeah, Pizza Inquisition. Forever and ever. Those look like they might be phylacteries. Oh, I finally got my neck to pop. It's good to bring Solas here, though, because I think he, he explains some things. Like, when you pick up the head, basically Talon's like, it's still warm. And Solas is like, that's because it's still alive. And I can just imagine Talon, like, staring at it and, like, Dorian being like, ah! <laughs> and Cassandra just being like, ugh. <laughs> Oh, Roma, it's 10.30, and pizza would make a decent brunch. Indeed. Pizza is good for all meals. These are they, these seem like they might be kind of low level. You have... Oh, man. Oh, man. Squirrel, you have questions? Ah, don't ask me! <laughs> so how do you do so much damage? Because I'm an archer. I'm an archer. And apparently rogues, in general, if you're a rogue, you deal a crap ton of damage. Like... A lot. The only back, like, the backfire of that, or whatever, the opposite of that, is that you don't take much damage before Golden Hala, before you get dead. So that's why it's a really good idea for, um, rogues to have, like, hit on guard, like, guard on hit armors and stuff. And also, like, you need to have your stealth and your evasion abilities, like, hard, hardcore. Oh yes, Ashley, I did. I did switch to my human character and I showed the coolest. And also I do have a tier 4 bow. I also only really use tier 2 or tier 3 stuff to make my armor and my uh, my weapons. Ooh, Dorian's a necromancer. He probably think, you're right. Dorian would probably be actually really interested in it. See, I was kind of picturing in the concept art, he makes that face when the Inquisitor is like stabbing the map. Dorian's like throwing his hands up in the air, like what? I just kind of imagine not throwing his hands up in the air, but kind of making that face like, eh. <laughs> but you're right, like, but he doesn't. I don't know. That would actually that's actually a really good point. Dorian would probably be pretty interested. The funny thing is though about. Dorian is that I don't really get the vibe that he's a necromancer like I understand he's not, he's not a blood mage for a reason but it's it's a little bit like he doesn't ever have like any dialogue really that relates to him being a necromancer like it's a little strange she won yeah but see bull doesn't really have much uh he doesn't have much constitution for whatever reason. I could see that happening. I one-shot things a lot. I'm, I get like 10,000, 11,000 damage, and it is a tier 4 bow. You're right. Do, there's usually, there's Veilfire. You can get it other places, but you're right. I should probably carry it with me for now. See, I love, like I said on Tumblr, I really like going on a Tumblr and seeing, like, the screen archers. And they get, like, close-ups of, like, stuff like this and stuff like this. And I really enjoy seeing, like, the little details in the world that sometimes you miss when you're just running through. I, I really like, and, like, I like seeing close-ups of, like, the Venatori and the Red Templars and stuff. It's really cool. I enjoy that. I, I really want to, I want to get the fly cam capabilities, too. My, like I, ha I had it for a while. I was messing with it. You can't quite find tier two others. Yeah, you gotta start going into higher. Like Fallow Myers only gonna have like tier one stuff. Um, and you start going into like Exalted Plains and stuff. But then you start getting like you start picking up armors and stuff that are too high a level for you. Ooh, nice. See, that's a good idea to get your iron bowl with a lot of health. That's a really good idea. Yeah, basically it's just a matter of like finding the nice schematics and um, and then getting like at least tier two material. I do like to use cotton though. Oh, there it is. Cotton has like a healing part. What, Dorian? What are you doing? Dorian, you don't get to participate. Oh wait, shoot. Dang it, Dorian, you're gonna have to participate. There you are. There we go. A mosaic piece. 